stuff in both of them right up to the end so you don't want to you don't want to back off three quarters of the way through the auction because i mean there's like on the jim stevers auction there's uh slot machines right at the end you know so i mean you just I mean, you gotta and, go and the other one's the same way there's there's good items all the way to the end um yeah i mean you know like el capitan always says you got to give it a hundred percent you can't just give it 92. that's right yeah that's right you know. All right. So anyway, we're uh, happy to bring you this. There's a lot of quality stuff all the way through. If you check out this auction, um, mid-century table. That's the first one. That's twenty. That's probably it's way better than that for five bucks. It's a it's a good name. I didn't search it or anything, but it is a good brand. Um, good mid-century designer. Nice condition. Well, it needs some refinishing, but I mean, it's well, yeah. it's solid. Yeah. Other than that, you know, it's not bad. We got the vintage dining room chairs. We got uh, that. We got this Snowbird uh, ice box refrigerator. That's at 135. That's in a lot better condition than that, too, in yeah, my I opinion. Think so. yep. uh, American Oak Buffet quarter sawn. That one's really nice. The problem with some of the pictures here is that we were, well, cramped for space. Yeah, once you check out the place, when you come to the pickup, you'll see why. Yeah, it was, um, we did the best we could with what we had. Um, and, then, and then like on 24, you got the taxidermy owl on Birch Branch. Um, you know, if you've always wanted one, this is the only way you're going to get one because you can't go out in the wild and get one. Nobody will, nobody will mount it for you. It's against the law. Yeah, so um, who wants it? That's right. <laughs> All right, on the Northern Pike. And uh, that one's a, it's a little pike, but it's a pretty nice mount there, $32.5. That's a nice mount uh antique 1938 park falls creamery milk can that's at 21 dollars. right in the heart of the great depression right there yeah. at 21 dollars. you got a nice coleman uh powerhouse lantern with a hard case on it uh, that's 20 lot 27 28 we've got a coleman model 288 h lantern with a hard case and both those cases are really nice the lanterns are nice uh 28a we've got that um two coleman fuel um 20 seconds left on that ice box. Let's oh, get wow. going. Come yeah, on. Wow. And uh, who wants the owl? It's only 38 seconds there too, huh? That's right. And uh, 185 Ooh. on that. It's, it's a pretty good shape. Yeah, it is. Um, ice box is going out right now. Um, the American Oak Buffet, that's got three minutes left. It's at $400. Um, the Mid-Century Oak Table, that's at $7 right now. That's got two and a half minutes left on it. Um, the owl is almost gone. It's at $185. You still 10 got seconds left. Let's go. Full Just a flick of the wrist and it'll be yours. Oh, yeah. Touch the mouse, you know, on your handheld supercomputer, That's whatever right. else. Four, four full Christmas trees, $21. 29 are antique flat top steamer trunk. It's ornate lock. That's at 23 bones. We got uh, 31, lot 31. We got 39 aluminum Mountain Dew bottles. They're at six bucks right now. And a lot of those have the Fast and the Furious stuff from around 2000. So yeah. they're kind of collectible. Yeah, you don't and you could right. drink them, probably. I think, uh, doesn't that soda get better with age? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't well, know. I thought it gets sweeter with time. Isn't there a country and western song uh, like something that? Something like that, yeah. <laughs> yep. Uh, there goes the Powerhouse Lantern. That's at 17 bucks. That's just closing out. Then we got the Coleman model 288H lantern with hard case. That's at 32 and a half. That's six nice seconds. That's got the large uh, large top on it. Yep. Good shape. There it goes right there. Uh, we got a few of those pieces of furniture ending up real quick, but that American Oak Buffet, that's still going at quarter sun at four bills. Yeah, still just under two minutes left on that. Still um, trucking. The Coleman uh, stove, that's going out right now. That insect fogger, that's got 10 seconds left on it um yeah i know just because you know you got some fog today with a little bit of snow well a little bit of snow. next well there it goes anyway no joke on that hey we got some lp records olivia newton john uh abba blondie and there's some 20 lp records and these were kind of some um they're obscure the items, yeah, yeah obscure stuff like you'd get at a at a show where they would just sell them afterward. Right. Chicago Bad Boys. I mean, it's a lot of stuff. It's unusual to have low production. A lot of the stuff's late 90s. Again, um, vinyl, there wasn't a lot made back then. No. So these could be real sleepers. $20 on those. 42 seconds left on them. 
We got the new home sewing machine stand with cast iron legs. It's at $50 right now. That's got 48 seconds left on it. And we've got those three vintage light up red toy soldiers. Those are pretty nice. Oh yeah. Um, they're at 90 bucks right now. We got 54 seconds left on those. We got a Michelob light gold um, golf bag cart um, with a hat organizer. Yeah. Um, that's three bucks. That's, that's at three beans right now. That's at 54 seconds left on it. Then we've got a lot 36B. We've got 10 glasses. Um, there's three wine and three Southern Comfort glasses. They're at a buck right now. Um, those are nice. Um, and then 36C, we've got two Pyrex uh, mixing bowls. Click on the audio, live audio video button if you want to see a live feed. And uh, keep in mind, again, the preview was yesterday. But the pickup is right here. So uh, we'll be sending out invoices after the fact um, and uh, that kind of thing, too. We got all sorts of stuff. Corel mixing bowl, six mulberry dinner plates. They're at two bucks right there. Yeah. 36C, two Pyrex mixing bowls, the EAPG glass reamer. Um, 37, we've got two Vinnie's light up red Noel candles and snowflake pattern on them. Uh, 39 or 38, 39, we got two more. Uh, sets of those. Uh, lot 40, we've got two vintage light up snowmen and a teddy bear. Um, these are the vintage ones or kind of the tall are, plastic ones. They're probably the blow molded ones, yeah. About three feet high, roughly, yeah, roughly ish, yep. somewhere in there. And then you got one that kind of looks like El Capitan there, 42. <laughs> it's got Mr. Oh, and Mrs. Oh, Claus. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Claus. Uh, snowman and teddy, teddy bear. One's at 140, one's at 130. Get them while you can. You yeah. don't see them too often. No. Nope. Um, and these are nice. Yeah, they're nice, too. And then uh, we've got three more lots of uh, candles, uh, 43 and 45 and 46. Um, those are like, like lot 30, lot 43 anyway is at $24. If Scrooge is your neighbor, you want to put these up right along the property line. That's exactly Have right. them all lit up <laughs> right there. If you got a fence, just put them right on the top. Right on the top. Oh, yeah. Get going he'd on be that. Happy. He'd oh, be happy I'm sure about he'd be <laughs> scroogey about it to start, but after a bit, he'd be okay. He'd lighten up. Oh yeah, lighten up, Francis. Yeah, that's right. All right, lot 47. We got four newer tall patio chairs. Um, they're at 70 bucks right now. They're really nice. Um, they got five minutes left on them, so you still got time to, to bid on those. Um, 46A. We've got that travel golf bag with wheels. Um, that was nice. Yeah, actually, both of those are, or the one there is, it's like, it's new. I don't think it's been used. So, um, you know, great for storing actually a bag too, because you don't get a bunch of junk in there. 49 is new in box mosaic gazing ball. No stand right there, $18. Um, perfect again to get the old neighbor, you know, <laughs> maybe happy. Right. I'm not sure. All right, lot 50. We've got two plastic drawers and two trash cans um good value lot right yeah, there Yeah, good value lot there at six bucks uh 50a we got that fine eight inch um yellowware mixing bowl that's at 40 bucks right now good blue stripe mixing yeah, bowl right yeah. there 40 bucks let's go and 50b we got three yellowware mixing bowls um they're stacking um, um they got a few little issues but yeah. they're still they display pretty nice otherwise we would have chucked them yeah. so uh yeah and uh we're really happy that everybody's here tonight so we have many... 242 bidders on tonight. Keep in mind, we do have another auction going on right now. And that is right, seriously, it's right across Highway 13. This one's kind of up by um, the bottling uh, plant, this uh, this pickup. No, and then AJ's Bar is right there on Division Street. Right. So that's just right across 13 pretty much and down a block and you're there. So uh, check that out and... Well, that one's on right now, so if you want to check, get going, that stuff starts ending at 8.30, and uh, we hope that you look that over as well. Because yeah, there's a lot of a lot of great stuff in that one as well, um, especially if you're looking at opening a restaurant or if you have a restaurant, there's some nice quality items in there. Yeah, everything from tables to chairs to, to dishes to glasses to, you know. Um, All sorts of stuff. And for the home, too. I mean, you can... Yep. There's, like, those eight-foot folding tables. You need one of those for the garage. I mean, there's a bunch of those. They're yep. the heavy-duty ones, you yep. know? Yep. Um, 
some nice stainless steel uh, serving stuff. Uh, yeah, stainless steel. You want a stainless steel prep table for something? There's some couple really nice ones. Yeah, you could use that if you want to cut deer. You want to uh, have that in the kitchen or something. Mm -hmm. You know, it needs a little cleaning up, but... Um, but we've got also on this one here, I mean, there's uh, 52A. We've got an antique arcade coffee grinding mill with case. That's at $18 right now. 52, we've got a green tool garden bench with a pegboard on the back. Um, 51A, we've got the Ginsu knives with wood block. Um, 52C, we've got five Oxford uh, cobalt blue nesting mixing bowls. Ginsu knives? Oh, my. Look at those, El Capitan. Yeah. yeah. Green tool garden bench with pegboard. That's great. Yeah. Ten bucks. I mean, the the pegboard is really nice. You, it's very versatile kind of a thing. So check that out too. We've got uh, 52D. We've got uh, Vinny's lamp bricks, butter crock. Uh, 53. We've got a large metal garage shop cabinet with doors on it. 54. We got a white farmhouse drop leaf dining table. And that one's. Uh, check that out. Check out the 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 legs on it. Yeah. Yeah, they're painted legs on it. And... and you also still want to keep looking at Lot 23 is an American Oak Buffet. It's quarter sawn, but it's very, very ornate. Very ornate. Uh, and check it out because seriously, it uh, you see a few of those out there, but you don't see them with that kind of ornateness. There's a couple of uh, almost lions, the, the Victorian era lions that are goofy looking, but that's what they are. Uh, what is it, a griffin? Kind of a half lion, yeah. something yep. like griffins up there, and uh, kind of neat. So that's at 480. You don't see that kind of stuff offered too often. And we've got lot 55. We got the new in the box pioneer tabletop stand. Um, again, it's new in the box. It's uh, for I don't know a stereo or TV or whatever it is. But then uh, 50, 55A. We got that vintage Lambrex butter crocs. There's two of those. Um, uh, let's see, we got 55B, we got uh, Rotafella bindings, belt buckles, can openers. Ski season's just coming up, and those have got the kind of duck bill things. The Rotafella, I mean, you can get your own ski boots for that and uh, get out there and cross country ski. It's really, I, I love to ski, and it's, uh, it's a great way to exercise, but also get around the country. And with those Rotafella bindings, you can just go. You don't need to go on a trail. You could go on a trail or you can go off. There goes that farmhouse tra table that's about to go. Green depression glass block optic 56B. By the way, if you're at Heckman Auction or if you're on Facebook or on YouTube, what you need to do is you need to go to heckmanauction.com and uh, bid now because we are ending this auction right now. Pickup is on Tuesday. We're at the Jim Stever online auction. The Stevers, uh, um, his father started the bottling company up there and uh, since have sold it a few years ago. But uh, they're, uh, they've had a lot of stuff in the Park Falls community, a lot of, uh, a lot of family and then a lot of uh, businesses and stuff. So yeah. they've been promoters of the community for many years. You want to keep in mind too, one of the, you know, when you're bidding on some of the stuff, one of the best things you can do is put in your maximum bid um, because then you don't have to follow along so closely and there's a lot of items ending. That way, if you if you have something that you're willing to go up to 60 bucks on and it's a, currently at 20, if somebody goes 21, you'll get it for 22. You know, I mean, the only way that they'll beat you out of it is if they go over 60 bucks. So, but that way it, it makes it easier on you when you're looking at all this stuff. Because there's a lot of action. A lot of people like to bid um, live, and yeah. that's great. And But, again, when you want to get to be, uh, I guess, an auction pro, you want to make sure that you actually have something out there, and then you can make a decision later on if, if you want to make a change. Large metal clothes rack right there. Um, two there's two of those, 59, 60. One's a little taller than the other one. 61 is a vintage drink squirt wooden crate. And these are got nice graphics oh, on them. Oh, these are too. beautiful. Yeah. Good condition. We got 62. We got those two cement block or cement roadblock sign holders. Um, one of them's kind of. Wonky, actually, but... those aren't sign holders. You can actually, you can put like put a two rope. by four oh, and block them. stuff off, you know? Oh, okay. So 
Uh, like I remember, no, I won't tell that story. Forget about it. <laughs> but it's nice, you know, when you want to kind of corral people that you could use that. They're pretty, they're, they're, they're nice. Oh, look at that. It's uh 63. It's like looking in the mirror again. Wow. There's that bag full of new and packaged Christmas bows, uh, new, new tag bags. So you need Christmas bags. I mean, Christmas bags are one of the greatest, like, dude inventions ever because you don't have to wrap stuff. I you know, just jam it in a bag and you're ready to go. <laughs> yeah. So uh, that's uh, that's one of the greatest things that somebody could – actually, I don't mind wrapping presents. It's kind of fun. But I know I, I don't – you know, it's a lot easier with the bags. So. There are times. <laughs> yeah. You just want to – as my old man would jam say, it a, in a bag of – Bag, who brought the baggage? <laughs> John <Kane'd say. laughs> Anyway, there we go. So well, we've got along along in here. We've got some great stuff and boxes of uh, new in the package Christmas ribbon, purple and red. We've got um, it's one, perfect. Yeah, great time right now. Oh yeah, one bag full of new in the package Christmas bows. A package of. Um, I know they don't have their Christmas shopping. I know you've been, you've been making a list and checking I've, it twice oh, for huh? a long time. Yeah. You know who doesn't. Yeah. Coming up, though, oh, my gosh, we got the uh, little red Corvette. It's an 89 red Corvette, six-speed manual, 65,000 miles on her. It's $6,200. Come wow. get it. And, and Hasn't talked, been driving, Mitch. I talked to a guy yesterday that said, give me three good reasons why I shouldn't buy this. And I went, I can't. <laughs> right. You know, you should buy it. I mean, 6200 bucks. You know, it's 60. Around 65,000 miles. Wow. And doesn't it have the removable top, I think? Yes, it's got the removable top in it. It's got aftermarket wheels and tires on it. Um, it's a Chevy 350, and it's the upgraded one. So the it, tune fuel injection on it. Yeah. That's, that's what it says on the side. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's got a minute and 22 seconds left on it. Um, you don't want to miss it. No. I mean, no. it could be like one of those silly Lexus commercials. You could put a bowl right on top of there. Oh, yeah. And say, oh, look what I bought myself. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> oh, that's for You're me. You're really surprised. Ooh. Exactly. <laughs> I don't know if you'll be able to fit that in the sleigh, El Capitan. Uh, you'd be surprised what we can fit in that sleigh. All right. And then we got more Noble Fur Christmas wreaths. 23 bucks right there. They're not real Noble Fur, but they're full. So they are... They are true evergreen, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, the little red Corvettes at 6,200. 40 seconds left. Let's go. Give it one more shot here. Yeah, wow. Yeah, there we go. 6,250. Yeah. Oh, don't let him do that to you. No, come on back. <laughs> come on back with us. If you're on uh, Facebook, go to HeckmanAuction.com and you can bid right now. Uh, the Amer Antique American Oak uh, Buffet, Quarter Son. It's really... You just got to check out the detail to it. It's at 570. Yeah. Let's go on that. That's it's beautiful. I mean, go piece. find one like that. You're not going to. You're not going to. Well, you can if you're right here. Yeah, well, another one like that. Another one like that. No. No, no, no. So Large that, wall mirror. That's coming up. That's at $0. Yeah. I mean. And red Corvette still at 6250 It's got just under three minutes left. You still have time. You know, think about 6250 for a Corvette. Wow. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I mean, yeah. It's Corvette. Let's go. That's every, it was, it's, isn't it almost everybody's dream car, kind of? Yeah, I always It's like so. one of the ones up there. It's Americana right there. Red Corvette, 6250, 89. Mm, yeah. There we go. You saw all the pictures to it. It's there. Christmas wreaths. We still got plenty of those. So if you want to be really festive this year, which would be a great year to be festive, why not? Let's go. Yeah. We've got, uh, you know, cl plastic Christmas tree stand and three wreaths. We've got, um, there's another Christmas tree stand. There's uh, 78, five new Christmas garland decorations. Some are lighted. 77, we've got 10 new Christmas garland. Some are lighted. Um, you know, this is, man, there's some great stuff here. To... Oak library table. That's an old one, 84. That one is an old oak library table. I mean, it's Mission. Yeah, Mission Oak, yep. Yeah. Yep, and uh, check that out. That's at 22 bucks. And 82, we've got the six-drawer East Lake dresser on casters. Why not? Let's go. It's at 115 there. 115. Yep. 
Still got time for you on the little red Corvette 6250. Got a minute and a half left. I guess I should have known about the way you parked your car sideways. <laughs> it's part of a little red Corvette, I think. Anyway, I do have some serious questions later on, El Capitan. I mean, serious. Oh, yes. Serious, serious questions. I find that really hard to believe, but I'll, I'll go along with that. All right, 83, we got a scroll iron vanity bench with Robin's Egg Blue Cushion, 25 bucks. And we've got 87, we got those four Imperial White Tail and two Clover and two Wintergreen uh, bags of seed. Don't give up on that buffet. Seriously, 570, very reasonable. It's nice, 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 uh, ornate. 10 seconds, let's go. And the Corvette, 6250, come on, 42 40. seconds. Why shouldn't you? Why shouldn't you? Can't think of one good reason. I think, you know, I would probably buy somebody a bow for that if you want. We could probably <laughs> splurge for that. I would do that. 28 yeah. seconds, let's go on that Corvette, 6250. One more time. Bring it back. Let's go. 20 seconds left. Oh, Don't, my you'll gosh. Be sorry. You Don't. Oh. Don't lose it. Let's go. Don't lose the little red Corvette. Oh, there it goes, 63. Yeah. Yeah. See, somebody wanted to wait right wait till the end. Minute, but yeah. see what happens here is we have extended bidding anything inside two minutes. But I like it. You know, you're waiting to see if somebody's sleeping. Maybe they think it's gone now. Yeah, right. And then, you know, hey. Boom. <laughs> Got yep. it. 6,300. Keep going on that Corvette. You won't be sorry. No. Naughty Pine side table. Distress finish. 13 bucks. That's lot 100. 102. Then we got some pedal cars. And these are nice, aren't oh, they? Like brand new? Nice. Yeah, they're really nice. 102. Ace Hardware panel truck pedal car. 120. 101. We've got an Ace Hardware advertising pedal fire truck. Uh, 104. We've got an Ace Hardware red panel truck pedal car. These are all pretty decent. Yeah, definitely. Look at this one. We got that antique five drawer or oak oh, yeah. five drawer dresser, five bucks. Wow. What are they thinking? I don't think they are. I don't think they've been shopping. No, I don't think lately. so. No, apparently no. not. You know, I know everybody wants other stuff, but you know, who doesn't want a red Corvette? Who doesn't want like a five drawer dresser right there? Six bucks. Let's go. You know, you're still getting a good deal. I mean, on the Corvette either, or the dresser? Either one. Either yeah. one. You know, Let's I mean, go. the antique dresser, it's at six bucks right now. If you go seven, it's still a good deal. If you go 10, it's still a good deal. Oh my gosh, it's way better. Good deal. Oh, yeah. Red Wing Birch Leaf, six gallon stoneware crock. It's at 40. Keep in mind that does have a hairline crack. Um, Thera Sauna, two person sauna, $900. That's at two minutes to go. Let's see here, 111, beautiful canoe book curio shelf. That's nice, too. Yeah, it definitely is. Then we've got 112, we've got that Raz wire mesh um, three-tier shelf unit. That's at 17 beans right now. We've got um, another one of those uh, uh, wooden canoes. That's 113, small canoe. This is shaped display cabinet. That's at 4250. That's a little bit smaller than the than uh, lot one eleven. Definitely. Um, we got one of our little pedal cars, the one hundred four. That's that's ending right now. That's got seven seconds left. Still time to hit it. Still time to hit it. Um, the other two still have about two and a half minutes left on them, so you still have time to to get in there and get a chance at them. I mean, you got grandkids. This is the time to grab the stuff. Definitely. If you don't have grandkids, they'll be coming along the way sooner or later. Could well, be. Hopefully. Wooden weaver's bench, drop leaf sides, thirty two fifty. Pine rack on casters, good condition, twenty one dollars. Uh let's see here. One seventeen, we got the eighty inch faux shrub, seasons of Cannon Falls ornaments. Um Lot one twenty one, we got that metal four seconds on the Corvette. Let's go. One oh, more. oh. And there it goes. Somebody got a good deal on that Corvette. You betcha. All right. 25 seconds left on the Thera Sauna. Let's go. That's, uh, that's a good price on it, yeah. Let's see here. Allison, 220 volt tanning bed. Hey, it's not a bad idea, you know, if you get a little depressed in the winter. 
fire up the old tanning bed and get the little sun. So, here Why we go. I you think you're on the beach down in Florida somewhere. Why not? Oh, yeah, we got a pair of uh, poly patio chairs that are usable condition. That's lot 119, lot 120. We got a pair of nice tall patio chairs with woven backs. Those are nice and comfortable. Tall according to who? Um, well, it gets you up off the floor. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think they're, what, 42, 43 inches tall in the back? I got you. I'm kidding. I know you are. All right, tape in any questions. Click on the audio video link to see a live video. Fold uh, vintage hotel keys, folding knives, three dollars. Oh, that'd be great for like doing a clue game. You have those like, <laughs> the fobs, right? Imagine setting up something like that. Be fun. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Indeed. Five drawer dresser still going. That's at thirty-two and a half now. Oh, oh my. Good. Ace pedal car, one thirty-five. Yeah. The one's still at one seventy-five. That's got nineteen seconds left on. So there's, you still have time to get that little fire truck. Man, isn't a sweetheart? Look oh, yeah, that. definitely. Let's go. Naughty Pine side table still going. We got a lot of people here online. How many we, we have? Got, Scott? 250 bidders awesome. right now. Thank you very much, everybody. Welcome, everybody. Yep. If you're on Facebook, go to heckmanauction.com and get in on the bidding. By the way, we do have another auction closing tonight. It's AJ's Bar. It's right across the street, really, from this place here. Yeah. Right in Park Falls. That's why we set it up that way. It was kind of, uh, what's the term? Fortuitous? Would that be it? <laughs> well, convenient, whatever. Something like that. <laughs> right? Stackable five section metal display shelf. 30 bucks. That's kind of a cool looking one. It yeah. almost looks like a, a lighthouse, El Capitan. Oh, no. Is that uh, kind of what you see in your dreams? <laughs> that and big waves. <laughs> yep, definitely. Backboard and hoop. That's at uh, two beans. 118, that Allison uh, 220 volt yellow tanning bed. Uh, that's uh, that's still going. It's a three beans right now. It's got a little over two and a half minutes left on it. Man, just think <laughs> what it would cost you to go to a, a tanning salon right now versus buying this thing. Um, we've got uh, 125. We've got some uh, Daisy 95 and uh, 1938B saddle ring uh, BB guns. Um, one of them has a, um, part of the cocking lever broke off. And 126, we got the Daisy Buck um, 10, the 105B BB gun. And that's a um, manure addition, uh, but it's in good condition. We've got a pair of Worthington Ladies small leather jackets. Um, that's lot 127, 123A. We got a uh, stealing garnet, garnet. I think that's a sterling. Sterling, that's a stealing. Yep, <laughs> sterling, garnet, ring, Justice League. Yep. Um, See, we got a pipe there. Oh Some my! Band pipe. Mm-hmm. And uh, 129, we got two signed and numbered Robert Metropolis prints. Is that right? Metro Metropolis? Metropolis, something like that. 22 beans right there. Yeah. Uh, keep in mind, also, let's see. I got a serious question though. When somebody types to you R O F L, how many of you are actually rolling on the floor? I would say almost nobody. You're rolling on the floor laughing. Has that ever happened to you? No. I Anybody? No question. mention? What's your other question? If you're the auctioneer, are they the auctionettes? I don't know. The bidders? Four eighty one, lot one seventy one, Corvette takeoff wheels and tires. Looks like three in the picture or three or four rims. I think there's all four rims. I think there is a set of four. I'm pretty sure they're all four there. Let's see. Can we scroll up to 171? I know there's five centers. 171. Nice wheels include five center caps and studs. Oh, that's a good question. Again, we were um, kind of elbows. To each other on that but uh 481 i i i'm not sure what'd you see el capitan um i'm pretty sure there's four there all right let me see no i can time. maybe there's one two three four 
one, two, three, four. Okay. I'm pretty sure they're all four there. I know they're all four there. I looked at them the other day. Okay. All four of them are there. 481, all four are there. There's two of them have the exact same tread on the tires, and the other two have different treads on them. But they're all four there. Um, the centers are there. Um, one in good condition. 143 rustic cedar top outdoor log table. That's uh, still going. 135, we've got the Mr. Heater, little buddy LP heater. If you're getting ready to go, well, that's got four seconds left on it. But uh, 131, we got new in the box Panasonic VHS DVD player. Um, it's new in the box. Uh, 136, we got a tote full of vintage and antique faucets. There's some really cool ones in there. Um, uh, then we've got uh, 137, nice folding ivy leaf metal and glass shelf cabinet that's at 21 dollars right now and the 138 we've got a coleman lp heaters tiki torch inserts um and 139 we've got a guardian automatic circuit transfer switch um 143a and 144a we got cedar top outdoor armchairs they're nice yes they're at 45 and 55 dollars check those out then the cedar top outdoor side table that's 143 check that out 143 and then there's another one at 144. Okay, and 145 we got a Seberg Symphonola jukebox that plays uh what? 78. 78. Yep. And it lights up um but the mechanism is jammed in the top um uh and then there's there's some of the mirrors in the front that are missing but there's a box full of them there. Um and also the some of the side plastic pieces are cracked but they are available. Um, there's people that restore those, and those are readily available. So um, this would be a really great unit. Um, you know, get a hold of some 78s, some rock 78s, or or if you like the older stuff. Um, 146, we've got the uni an antique national cash register with the embossed nickel um, front on it. That's pretty nice. Last patent dates, uh, 1919 on that. It's got a little... Uh... Kind of a cracking on that marble but you know still pretty neat unit yeah that that um also on the back side of the the drawer it, it shows the company that it was initially made for um is that local no it was model 300 the last patent date is is uh well, yeah 1919 the register number is on there um i guess i think let me take a look i think i it was originally made for Ely Photo Studio in Ely, Minnesota. All right, from Ely, Minnesota. There we go. Yeah, back in 1919. Uh, new in box Panasonic VHS DVD player. It's at 165. There's yeah. a sleeper right there. You yeah. can't find them too much anymore. No, I knew they were like two and a half, or they were. Um, uh, 157 vintage coin op Sandy Horse Pony Machine. That's at 600 bucks. That's sweet. Yeah, it's kind of neat. Uh, that came, where did he say it was from? It was from one of the local places. Yeah, one of the anywhere. local places. Uh, right. Um, you know, and it's the tail on it's broken off, but the tail is there. Um, it, you know, you'd have to, but the, the horse itself is all, it's, it's die cast of some sort. It's either pot metal or aluminum, probably pot metal. It has a real leather saddle on it. Um, as opposed to a lot of them that have the molded saddle right into them. This one's real leather, so that's kind of neat. Um, Keep on betting. Let's go. That's that is pretty sweet, and uh, I'm sure with a little bit of stuff, you can get it going. Yeah. I, you know, I might be talking be to a guy named Dave Botts. He might be interested in something like ah, that. Well, one can uh, only hope. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, you should get it. 158. Good for your grandkids. Yeah, 158 GT Bicycles Performer BMX Bike, oh. and that's a better quality yeah. uh, BMX bike right there. I mean, Gosh, when you were 12, that's the bike you wanted to have right yeah. there, at least for me, uh, my era, I suppose. And you gotta, can't forget that uh, Lot 153, that St. Croix rod display rack that's in good condition. No. And, and 155 dot Transport Semi and Van Toy, that one's probably better than that. That's $25 now. Yeah. But that's uh, that's pretty cool. The St. Croix rod display case, that's going out. It's 10 seconds left. I mean... It's great to, to have that uh, just for the garage, for rods and reels.
And that uh, the Seberg Symphonola, that's at 3.30 right now. That's got a minute and 15 seconds left on it, so you still got time on that. Just think about that in, in the man cave, you know, and that would be fantastic. Get that all set up, and and uh, there's places that restore them if you don't want to do the work for yourself. Um, you know, when it lights up, it's, it's really neat. Um, GT Dino NFX BMX bike, that's at 55 bucks. Trek Mountain Lion 30, a girl's bicycle, that's at two bucks. So you can get some bicycling in there and get yeah. it ready for the spring. Lot 162, they got the nice vintage luggage cart. Um, right now, the, the uh, coin op horse is on top of it, but um, that's pretty nice. And then uh, lot 163, we got that vintage coin op scale. That's at $25 right now. It's got four minutes left. We have 302 open lots still. There's still time for you, so get up on here. Some uh, great items coming up. If you're on Facebook, go to HeckmanAuction.com and get yourself in on the bidding. It's going to be fun. Yeah. Well, it is fun right now. 299 oh, open lots. Yeah. Out of 444. Oh, my we've got, goodness. Um, coming up here, we've got lot 167. we got that Subi uh, Premium Collapsible Aluminum Scooter. Remember when those were the rage? Yeah, and they only collapse when you want it to. <laughs> That's that's an important yeah, fact. Yeah. Definitely. Lot 168, we got a really nice split panel door. It's 82 inches tall. You know, it's right in the you know in the middle where you can open up just the top half. And you know what that reminds me of? Wilbur. Wilbur. A horse is a horse. This is true. <laughs> Heck of a stall. He opened that top door up. A Dutch right. door. Yeah. Right? Yep. Uh, so now we've got uh lot 170. We got that nice vintage wooden Pepsi Cola soft drink box. That's a 19 right now. Um, the graphics are a little faded, but they're still pretty decent. Um, lot 171, we got that 89 Corvette takeoff tires and wheels. Um, you know, they're they're all four there. Um, you know, Original they, from an 89 Corvette. Yeah, they came off the Corvette that just sold a couple minutes ago because that had aftermarket tires on it. Let me ask you this, another serious question. Though. Okay. Who actually uses a glove compartment for gloves? Hmm. That's a good question. <laughs> it's called a glove compartment. I don't think anybody puts their gloves in there, but that's just uh, that's have. just me. Yeah, I mean, driving gloves for a Corvette. I could see that, maybe. Uh, vintage coin op scale. Is that, that, is that a good one right there? 63? Yeah. I think we're missing out here on that coin op scale, aren't we, El Capitan? I think so, it's too. It's kind of an art deco one. Yeah, well, you don't see them that often. No, you don't. So... Two minutes left on that. The coin op scale. Um, yeah, check that out. Trek 220 mountain bike track ladies or ladies bicycle. That's at $40. But that coin op scale, I think that's probably better than that. Yeah, I do too. What do you think? Uh, there goes Sandy the horse, 670 now on her. Or him. I'm not sure. Sandy. Drop leak leaf oak table with a metal frame. That's 177 that Seberg uh, Symphonola jukebox, that's currently at 410. That's got just about four minutes left on it. Sandy's up to 690 right now. It's got a little over three minutes left on it. I mean, there's still time. You know, it's uh, it's going to be a while before you find another one. Definitely. 180, Land Shark Lager, Shark Bite Table and Chair. That's kind of a cool looking one, you oh, know? Oh, that's very awesome. If you got If you got a place with a little beach, that's just a perfect little setup. Yeah, it, it's, it's it? really cool. Even if you don't. <laughs> you could pour some sand out on the front yard. Why not? <laughs> Sit there with a beer in your hand. For sure. It doesn't have to be a land shark. but Coin off scale still going. That's at 30. Three caster dollies. Uh, kind of like snowmobile mover, movers. Eight by eight. Those are the heavy duty jobs. They're the $21 there. 178 six foot tall freestanding floor lamp. That's at a bean. Everybody needs a floor lamp, and, you know, you dump them over, and then, you know, you got to get another one. So why not have an extra one? I mean, that's only $1. Come on now. Uh, let's see. Sandy, the horse is at 700 Seberg still at 410 There goes the cash register. Cash going register out just went at 85 Yep. Right. Seberg's at 410 has still got two and a half minutes on it, so you still got time. Um, we've got the three truck tires size. 265 70R 17s. They were pretty decent condition. They're at, excuse me, seven bucks for three tires. Um, boy, that, that sure beats going by 
buying them for 240 bucks a piece, don't it? I would think. And, you know, they are awesome rolling down a hill when nobody else is watching. Ghosting. Yeah. Oh, inside yeah, of them? Just you mean? One of the, oh. <laughs> no, no, just a ghost. They call it ghosting. Oh, I know. Rolling down the hill. Oh, man. Just a fun time. I'm down in Baptist Hill in Prentice, Prentice, Wisconsin, doing some ghosting. Anyway. Yeah, that land shark go. lager, um, shark bite table and chair. That's at 120 right now. It's at one. Um, that's still going. It's still got three, three minutes and 10 seconds left on it. Um, coming up, we've got a, a, a Cooper wooden barrel that's 30 inches high. Um, and we've got uh, 185. We got six bushel baskets with wire handles. 186. We got uh, five bushel baskets with wire handles. 187. We got six gas cans that are metal and plastic. Um, 188. We got a rolling clothes rack with 37 by 62. You need it. You need it. 189. Three spades and three flat shovels. They're in good condition. They're at 24 dollars. Check them out. The 190. We got a tonneau cover and automotive window tint. Um, and then. Umbra. Well, Tano is T O N N E A U. It's always a tough one. But uh, the Tano cover right there, drapery rods. Oh, look at that. You know, that stuff's kind of new, isn't it? Oh, yeah. that's one of those covers for in the back of your Yukon or whatever else. Right, so it's right. one of those pullover right. covers for in the back of a GMC or a or, Chevy. Yeah, or, or a Chevy. Or a yeah, Chevy, you know, or an SUV of some kind. Vintage jet vac, two speed shop vacuum. I mean, you got speed that's, it's like. It's jet light. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so there's two speeds to it, not just one. Just not just one. Yeah. Nope. 430 is a Seaberg Fanola. It's still going. 145. That's at $430. Yep. 157. Sandy's still going at 730 now. Let's go on Sandy. I wouldn't let her get away from me. Nope. 197. Uh, 197. Master Mechanic 10 inch table saw that's 197 that just popped up on the board that's 42 a, and a half 42 and a half yep we got those three rolls of plastic sheeting and a poly tarp that's what lot 196 that's at 2750 um we've got a sealed can of lincoln fleet weld welding rods that are 60 tens um how wide is that uh, plastic sheeting i don't know i have no idea huh? i don't know might be great for having like a little skating rink out in backyard bet yeah. you could make it work with that but you could. Yeah, just spray some water on. We got that eight by ten rustic ponderosa cabin rug. That's at a hundred dollars right now. Um, then we've got uh, a welding rod I was telling you about. That's at ten, eleven dollars right now. That's ten pounds um, of welding rod. Um, it's a sealed can, so it's brand new um, and sealed. You don't have to worry about the fact that it's, you know, it hasn't been damp, so it's still still really good. Um, Two hundred. We've got. Where'd that one go? Five cans of Johnson's Outboard Lubricant, an O-ring, and more. 201, we got a scraper, spade, scoop shovel, brakes, brooms, broom, not brooms. Broom? Oh, my gosh, all Good. sorts of stuff. Lots of work there, lots of good value. True value. <laughs> True value. Oh, is. <laughs> True value. Oh, yeah, definitely. Which is coming up. Um, we've got coming up, one of the things we've got on a lot here tonight is a, I believe it's a True Value Hardware Diorama. Could be 265. I don't know. It might still be there. It might not be. 265. Uh, open lots. 265 open lots. We are happy that you're there. here. Why well, was it supposed to be taken out? I don't know. I put it back in. Okay, good. Uh, there we go. So, uh, keep in mind, we do have another auction coming out shortly. Ho, ho, hold it there, Scott. Oh, my gosh. Let's tell them about the Christmas auction we got coming up. Let's do that. We've got a Christmas online Christmas auction. We had we would like to have done it in person, but um, it's online only auction. Um, we, it's online right now. It's got some great items on it. The first item in there is a really really nice Cub Cadet wood splitter. It's a peach. It's a peach. This thing's only probably been used a couple times. Yeah, I bet you it's split like under a hundred sticks of wood. I bet. Yeah. Less than that yeah. maybe. And it's it's um, and it's. Um, it tells a tale for the auction. So uh, there's there's a lot of great items in there. Um, so take a look at that. That gets over next Sunday night, correct? Next Sunday, you know it. So take a look at that and and uh, just jump on some of the stuff on there. Buy some great stuff for yourself. 
Um, but uh, join the crowd. Yeah, get up on it. Let's see here. What else we got? 205 is a glass top patio table, 40 inch diameter. Wow. Oh, goodness gracious, that's at 110. 206, we got a pair of unused notched 18 inch disc blades. Um, those are great for um, cutting up corn stalks and stuff like that. And especially if you. Um... You can balance on them and spin too. They're pretty fun. <laughs> okay, I'll believe you. Um, 208, we've got a lighted fluorescent open sign. Oh, we do. It's at 47 and a half. Is that fluorescent or is that neon? Looks like a neon. I'm not sure. It's one of the two. Anyway, it's, it's an open it's, sign. It's neon. I'm pretty sure it's. Oh, oh, I see. Lighted fluorescent. No, I think it's neon. Large 209 is a large display cabinet. That's at 32 and a half dollar. Yeah, 213. We've got a Kurt Adler lighted full Christmas tree. Um, that's uh, that's a four foot. Um, we've got 210. We've got a seven foot lighted full Christmas tree. 211 is a seven foot lighted uh, unlit full Christmas tree. Um, we've got a 209, 209. We've got a large display cabinet. Uh, 215. We've got a True Value Hardware Diorama. Um, this thing is really neat. Um, it's it was presented to. It's all in it's all in the description, so if you can take a look at that. But um, there's a little plaque on the bottom. 250 is an aluminum Cardinal Country eight foot by one foot sign. So if you graduated before uh, Glidden in Park Falls, or you know that's it was the Park Falls Cardinals before that, so it wasn't very long ago. So kind of a neat sign to have. I mean, wasn't that long, but that's the kind of stuff that in 30, 40 years, it becomes a $400 sign, you know? So it's at 22 bucks right now. That diorama, it's uh, it, there's a brass plate on it that says presented to the Southside Hardware. That's in Park Falls, I believe. Lionel O-Gage tracks some train cars, $8. Let's go on that. Let's see, the 8x10 rustic uh, cabin rug is still going. Then we got those O'Neill motorcycle boots, size 11. That's 254 and 255. We got that ultimate winter boot, size 11, with thin thread in them. And uh, pretty decent condition on those yeah, too. All of them, yeah. And they're, you know, that's a better quality kind of a, kind of a boot. I guess there's a little bit of chipping on the tongue on the one, but I mean, you know, it's going to be a decent, decent setup for you. Very nice pitching horseshoes and some ping pong stuff. Those pitching horseshoes haven't been used too much. I'll tell you that. Uh, still, we've uh, the Sebring uh, Symphola jukebox is still going. It's at 450 right now. It's got 23 seconds left on it. One more time. Let's go. One more One time. More time. Vintage co uh, coin up Sandy Horse. Uh, that's at 780 right now. That's got two and a half minutes left on it. And that Land Shark Logger uh, Shark Bite Table and Chair is at 170, and it's got a minute and a half left on it. So there's time on all of these. Uh, the jukebox is going out. It's got two seconds left on it. Keep in mind, too, we are going to be, the pickup is on Tuesday from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. That's Tuesday. In both places. The 15th, yes. And seriously, they are like. Block and a half, two yeah. blocks apart. Yep. If you get a bad parking spot, you might be parking right between the two. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, but it's uh, it's right there. So it's, it's really convenient. You can bid on both items or both things. So check out that other auction. After we're done with this one, yep. they do overlap just slightly, but we're going to be doing that one next. Antique hourglass shaped back parlor chair. So it's kind of a, um, that's actually an Art Nouveau style of chair. And it's uh, really, you know, some of the joints are separated, but it's, it's actually got original uh, upholstery, it looks like. And some other interesting stuff on there. So you, it might be something you want to look at because. We've got, and we've got several uh, drink squirt wooden crates coming up here. Um, this first one's the best though. Oh yeah, definitely. And it's at 17 bucks right now. It's got thir 31 seconds left on it. I mean, it's got good graphics on it. Um, you know, that's, uh, man, if you're a squirt person, how can you not want one of these? And those are older ones too. I yeah, mean, they are. I would say from the 40s or 50s, somewhere in there. Huh? Yeah, I would say 50s, definitely. Um, and then also 258, 59, and 260, we've got those uh, vintage sun-kissed oranges wooden crates um, with a red globe on them. Those are, those are pretty nice. Um, 
Then we've got 263. We got that wooden or that, that full office tree. There are some lights on it. They're untested. 264, we got a metal footlocker trunk. Um, and then 265, we got an antique wooden slab trunk um, with original tray in it. Um, inside of it is it is a little moldy, uh, but you should be able to scrub that out. I mean, it's it's the full office tree is a lot better than that six bucks. I mean, oh yeah, you no, know, it's always nice to that have about something seven green. Foot tall. It's about seven foot tall. Yep, it's it's pretty nice. 14 seconds left on Sandy the uh, the horse the pony. It's at 780 now. Eight seconds left. One more time on it. It's about to close, and there it goes. And then uh, eight by ten rustic Ponderosa cabin rug. That's at 136 seconds left on that. Thank you all for all of your bids. Yep. The True Value Hardware Diorama. It's at 47.50 right now. Um, you know, there's. You're not going to find another one of these. It's definitely a true value. It's definitely a true value indeed. Um, we've got um, some more of these uh, squirt. Uh, there's another one that just closed right now. That's at 19. There's another one that's got uh, 266 drink squirt uh, wooden crate. That's at $19. It's got 40 seconds left on it. Um, we've got uh, 267. We got some garden tools. Um, there's a hoe, shovel, and a 30 gallon uh, trash can. Um, 268. We got a pine display rack with an arch on it. Um, and then uh, 271. We got that plastic. Uh, Ronrico rum. It's like a witch's cauldron. Yeah, but it's plastic. Oh, man. Well, still. But still, yeah. You need the big cauldrons. You don't want to move around. I mean, this is kind of a no, cool cauldron. No, you can't move them around. <laughs> no, you can't. Well, you can. Well, yeah, you lay them on the side and roll them around. Yeah. 274, we've got that Welch gingerbread clock case. There's no movement in it, but the case is pretty decent. It is. It's not from 1855. It's from 1885, roughly. I don't. I think I typed that, and I just mistyped but it's from 80 about 1885 it's uh right in that uh, aesthetic movement it's got like bamboo and storks and that's just right in that wheelhouse right there 11 bucks and you know honestly the cases are the toughest thing because yeah. that's that's usually what's not original and so if you find a welch movement which there'd probably be a lot of similar ones that'd be a pretty decent clock yeah that's only 11 dollars there now we've got a couple lots of safety book matches. There's a lot 276. There's 2,500 books of safety book matches um, in uh, that lot. That's $11 right now. And we've got that's that's actually um, we could have renamed it. Yeah, we could have renamed it Smokey the Bear's Nightmare. <laughs> right there. <laughs> that's kind of like yeah. I saw a cartoon one time that the. Smokey Bear had his eyes covered, and it was his birthday, and they're bringing him out a birthday cake, and had a whole bunch of trees on it. They're all on fire. <laughs> My God. <laughs> Happy two, birthday to you. <laughs> 275 is a bean pod candles table. So, um, again, an advertising table. It's at $30. 278, we got another 2,000 boxes of safety book matches. Um, so there's two lots of them, 276 and 278. It's actually 2,000 books of safety book mass matches, so not, not boxes. boxes. Okay. Yeah. And, you know, sometimes autocorrect gets us. Yeah. 281 and 280. We've got those road barricades with cement bases. These are like the, the ones that sold earlier. Um, they've got slots on them. You can put two by fours in to block a, an area completely off, and they got a cement base on them, so they're not going to just blow right over on you. No, um, they're not. They're definitely not going to do that. No, they're not. Um, two eighty two. We've got another vintage drink squirt wooden crate. It's at eighteen dollars. Um, lot two seventy seven is one, and lot two seventy three. Seventy yeah, two seventy three. So we got those two are at twenty one dollars a piece. Two seventy three and two seventy seven. Two two eighty two is at eighteen dollars right now. These are these are nice. These are nice. Two eighty five is a vint or it's actually an antique oak hall mirror tree. Oh mirror. yeah. And that one um, is very, that's actually very Art Deco. It's kind of a late arts and crafts era, but it, you see all the squares there, probably the late, late era of that, probably in the early 20s, I would guess. Yeah, and it's got umbrella stands in the back corners of yeah, it. Yeah, and um, the copper underneath, and it's yeah. in pretty good shape. That's at 410. Uh, but seriously, go find something like that yeah. because it's pretty... It's an interesting um, arts and crafts design, late arts and crafts, in my opinion. So, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it's, it's, well, it's got quarter saw and old pieces in it. And 
279 is a Bicentennial Liberty table, and that one's a flip down. Flip down. That's a $13. Um, oh, so, one of those? Okay. Yeah, so flip up. I mean, yep. I don't know what the purpose of that is. It's almost like a... Oh, it's easy to clear that way. That's true. <laughs> Just get this off of here. Mm -hmm. There we go. 275, um, we got that Bean Pod Candles table. Um, that's at 30 bucks right now. It's got a minute and a half left on it. Um, what else we got here, Scott? 10, 10, 284 is a large wooden wine rack. It's only at 10 bucks. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Does not anybody drink wine anymore? I guess not. Oh, maybe they just don't store it. Um, is there... Okay, gotcha. All righty. Um, let's see. 287. We tried this. We don't usually have reserves. There's a few reserves they wanted on these, the BMW stuff. So we did uh, put reserves on those. That's why those little exclamation points on there we try not to do that but uh you know we also have to make sure that we uh adhere to what our customer wants so and uh that's just how it goes yeah there's four items in here like that they're all bmw parts yeah uh 295 is a barrel pump for 55 gallon barrel that's at 18 dollars 296 bell and gossett booster pump series 112 dollars 284 we've got that ar blue clean um power washer it's at 80 bucks let's go on that yeah, yeah it's uh mckeeson folding walker that just closed vintage runner sled that's at 25 dollars 286 is a homes three speed tower fan seven bucks see you know what i want to know about the older generation they use those runner sleds and they're all going down a hill that's icy because that's a, the only way a runner sled would go yeah and now everybody's yeah everybody's <laughs> like you can't even let kids go sledding anymore what the heck is going on it's just i mean maybe a lot of you guys survived i don't know oh, yeah. Capitan. we used to go down the hill with with no sled 290 is a Wagner Power Painter 5.4 GPH. That's only at 10 bucks. I mean, uh, get up on that. Well, 298, we got the Rhinelander Beer Shorty Bottles in case. Um, that's actually, that's got the 12, um, 12 uh, pack cases that lift out. Yeah, um, so kind of neat. all complete, the bottles, everything, you know, and you don't see the, the Shorty Bottles very often. We've got um, two in two ninety nine. We got clothes rack that's disassembled. Two three hundred. We got uh, uh, neo neon Halloween uh, orange stack lights. Um, three hundred one. We got some flying ducks wall decor and brass repose plates. Three hundred two. Hamilton Beach professional drink master. Oh my, fourteen bucks. Three hundred three. Six vintage and antique oak. Actually, those are really nice pressed back oak chairs. Yeah, there. there's there's actually six, but two two of them are really for parts only. Um, but uh, but yeah, there's six, and then you know, and then you've got that uh, 304, that vintage oak dining table. That thing's beautiful. It's got six leaves with it. I believe it's 48 inches square, and with the six leaves, it it'll probably go out to. Oh shoot, that's something else. Six leaves is 12. It probably goes out to over 108 inches. Yeah. So it's a pretty nice big table right there. You want a nice solid table too. That's uh, kind of the one you want. Oak. Yeah. It's big. Yeah, it's heavy yeah. duty. You can. Plus, it's small enough where you know you can just have a, two people eat on it and that type of stuff. But yeah, if you the wanna... table is 41 inches square. There are six leaves that are all about 11 and a half inches wide. So the total table would be a little over nine foot long with all the leaves in it. Wow. So you could uh, have some friends over and, you know, eventually, um, you know, and then you know, that'll and, be and fine, when, I think. And when you're not using it, you know, it's a nice small table. It'll fit in just about any kitchen. That's true. It will. So, so, and it's got the stretchers too. It's not just a single leg base. Right. So it spreads out and it's got that extra foot, foot that kind of moves. Yeah. So it works really nice for that. A pair of nice swivel rocking patio chairs, oh, 280. Yeah. Oh my. Yeah, those, those are, are nice, nice right yeah. there. Then those uh, 212, those uh, four stacking patio deck chairs. Um, these these are, I think these are taller ones as well. Uh, yeah, they're 44 inches tall, and these are really nice. And you sit on them, the, there's a rail across the bottom. It's just right for foot height, so um, those are pretty decent. Then we've got that uh, 313, we've got the Nunabox uh, Farberware four-slice toaster oven. That's at 16 bucks right now. It's, it's new in the box. 
Um, then 314, we've got two Stansport Coliseum seats that are new with tags. Oh, my. Yeah. Coming up on the 8 o'clock hour, we still got 185 lots coming up. And there's a lot of stuff all the way through here. You don't want to stop. Don't stop right now. Keep no, going. Because there's, there's good stuff all the way through this auction. Yep. So we're happy to be able to present it to you. Uh, Coliseum chairs are going. There's a 10 bucks Pampered Chef Bacon Press. It's at $13. New inbox Bella Panini Grill, 16 bucks. Oh man, some shorties. The Rhinelanders. Yep, another Rhinelander again. shorty case with bottles. Yep. It's at 30 bucks right now. It's got two minutes left on it. Um, 180 on that big oak table now. Let's see what else we have here. Bella Professional Triple Slow Cooker and Buffet, and that's new in the box, isn't it? I yeah, think it is. Yeah, we got that uh, 309. We've got Chocolate Fondue Fountain. That's got 10 seconds left on it. Oh, man. And we've got that uh, large display cabinet. That's uh, Lot 209. That's still ticking along at 90 bucks right now. It's got 53 seconds left on it. Um, those oak chairs, six vintage oak dining room chairs, are 11 bucks right now. They're nicer than that. Oh, way nicer than that. They're the press back oak. Yeah. Those are old chairs the right there. In them. Oh, yeah. I think there's a there's one of them that has a hole in the caning, but with the two parts chairs are there, there's a good couple good seats so you can just change them out. And we're back. Sorry, I missed you there for a minute. Oh, goodness. Anyway, we're here, yeah. here. We're here just rolling along. We're, we're chucking. Thank you all for being here tonight. Yeah. Um, again, we've got, uh, all sorts of stuff. Um, at 318, we've got a new in a package golf club travel bag, you know, for if you're traveling on aircraft or whatever, you know, you can slide your bags in there and it uh, makes it easy to travel. And 319, we've got that Bella Professional Triple Slow Cooker and Buffet Server. Um, 320, we've got aftermarket aluminum wheels for a 325i BMW. They're at $35 right now. There is a reserve on those. Um, 321, we've got a new in-box Pioneer uh, speaker system. That That's uh, the longer ones. They, they're really good on, on flat screen TVs, plasma TVs. 322, we've got three Frito-Lay chip bag hangers. Um, these, are, these have multiple. Um, there's three of them, and each one has like three... Um, Vertical pieces, so that you can they'd hold quite a few. And then 323, we've got three new in the package Frito Lay chip bag hold hangers, and these are just a, one single um, beam that you clip the chips onto it. But those are new in the package. Um, 324, we've got two new in the package Miller coolers and a Mountain Dew cooler. And who can use that? Six bucks. You can use it all for all sorts of stuff too. I mean, you you Keeping know you want to cool. yeah and lunch and everything else yeah. too oh yeah four guitar heroes guitar sharp vhs player uh so there's a vhs player in there yep. untested but uh they look to be okay uh let's see here the vintage milk can that's been painted that's 21 dollars right now that's lot 329 330 we got a gold light folding walker with caster wheels and brakes that was nice 215 on that oak dining room table. It's still going. At, it's at 215. That's uh, still under the money, in my opinion. But uh, then again, what do I know? New in box. New in box. Anderson patio door grills. Yeah, there's two boxes, and each one has two grills in it. Um, I don't. I think the sizes are listed in the um, description. We've got that 331. We got that folding uh, Providence vanity mirror with bevel glass. Two bucks on that. Wow. You betcha. 333, we've got a wooden crate with double compartments. That's at $7 right now. Keep on bidding. Yep, keep going. Let's go. 334, we've got a lot of four pictures, two are signed prints. 335, we've got a glass patio table. I believe that's a taller one, too. And uh, yeah, it looks like kind of that's a 30 set inches, of one. 30 inches tall, 30 inches square, and 30 inches tall. 35 well that's normal size then. Yeah. 35 dollars on that though and it's a little bit of a smaller one though uh 336 three interesting brown tone art prints by odu check they're okay. all cross-country skiing and uh 
Very good condition. Almost looks like the Berkebiner there. Yeah. 337 is uh, is another group of them. There's three in there as well. I mean, with that brown tone, it's kind of cool. They look like sepia. Sepia, yeah. yeah. And yep. 339. Um, we've got two grouse prints by the Rough Grouse Society. Um, and then uh, 338, we've got two art prints by a local artist, Art Long. He's over by uh, Woodruff. Um, I've been to his place and seen some of his stuff. He's a nice art artist. He does um, paintings. He does um sculpture and stuff like that so he does some really great stuff yeah and he's well been known for quite a while and yeah. these are early these are early prints of his so um 60 bucks is i think is really a good deal i think these are i don't remember when 1984 yeah. yeah art's been uh doing that for a long time art's been doing art for a while yeah <laughs> And Imagine. he is a heck of an artist. Yeah, I guess he that he, that's why he was named that, and that's <laughs> what he is. He's an artist. Yeah, he does and, good work. Uh, yep. So Art Long and uh, Art must be close to 80 now, huh? I would guess. There. Yeah. Yep. Been, uh, been he's quite been, a... He's been arting for quite a while. He has. <laughs> yep. Two grouse prints by the Rough Grouse Society, $18. Three outdoor scenes prints. Let's see. Good. They're signed. Let's see who they are. Oh, we got some bird dogs. We got fly they're fishing. Nice. We yeah, got some. Nice. Yeah. Yep. That's only at four bucks. Only Come four on. bucks. That's what a buck a piece. Get out of here. Wow. Yeah. All right. Holmes, three speed tower fan. That's at $19. Let's go. Keep on it. We still have. Let's see. What do we got, El Capitan? 157 oh. lots. By the way, we will send out invoices after the entire auction's over. After both auctions are over. Yeah, I don't think we'll be able to get to this first one. Probably that's right, El Capitan, because we're going to have to switch over. Yeah. Anyway. Um, that, that vintage oak dining room table is at two fifty right now, and it's uh, it's got two minutes left on it, so there's there's still time. It's, it's a nice table. Definitely. Um, what else we got here, Scott? We've got uh, we still got those two art prints by a local art, artist, Art Long. I mean, those are great. They've got 10 seconds left on them. You still have time. Yeah. Hit, um, up, hit them up. Yeah, definitely. I mean, they're really nice um, pencil sketches is what they look like. We should probably talk uh, a little bit about, too, we got that antique auction coming up for next month. That's right. That's right. Don't want to forget that. We've got an antique auction um, that we're going to be doing for January. And um, we'll take consignments right up till the end of the month, I think. This month. Good consignments. Yeah. yeah. We can fill it up. Uh, we've got one ending, and we'll be taking good consignments. For that we've got some really kind of interesting stuff mid-century stuff stuff you're not going to see a lot of i mean we actually have some really good pewter in this auction oh wow uh it's some really good china too i mean we got uh a bunch of really good china i'm talking like high 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 end you know stuff that's 80 dollars a plate new that type of stuff wow big big expensive stuff but some of it's actually dishwasher safe even too um and there's there's some really nice furniture Definitely. There's some great East Lake furniture. Yeah. Uh, we've got a wonderful stove, that, that oh, stove yeah. over there. Yeah. So there's a lot of good stuff on this antique auction. and um, We'll be getting more and we'll be able to take more. Yep. So we can take a lot more than normal because we aren't having a live crowd this year, unfortunately, for our January antique auction. So more is a mirror for that. You know, if you bring a bunch of furniture, we won't have room for that. But if you got some great other kinds of things. Got some small, some re yep. medium sized stuff. Yep, let's go. Bring it on in because, yep. uh, you know, we can uh, roll it out for you and we'll be happy to. Vintage Oak dining room table. That's a 290. That's more antique, actually. So uh, yeah, go with more. it. Yep. That uh, Bella Professional Triple Slow Cooker and Buffet. That's a 3750 right now. That's got three minutes left on it. Um, the Let's see, we've got three pairs of good used rollerblades. They're at three bucks right now. They got a minute left on them. Uh, that uh, glass patio table, that's at 45. That's got three minutes left on it. Um, the three outdoors uh, scenes, prints, they're at seven bucks right now. We've got some wine glasses coming up. Um, there's a bunch of glassware. There's a bunch of Southern Comfort advertising glasses. There's uh, a lot 353, uh, 354. Uh, 355. Um, we got martini glasses, 356 yep. and 357. We've got uh, some Miller Life um, pint glasses. There's a box of 20 of those. They're you know they're all in the box. 
Um, a lot, and there's another lot of eleven. Buy me a pint, El Capitan. No, oh, you betcha. Um, a box of uh, mixed beverage glasses. That's lot three fifty two. That's ending right now. Um, I mean, these are all in really nice condition. Lot 361, a lot of six nice uh, wine glasses. Uh, and you got brandy snifters and 360. Yep. Oh, my goodness gracious. Brand, brandy snifters are great for drinking stouts out of two. Hey, thank you, 297, for uh, – we appreciate that. We appreciate everybody bidding, too. Yeah, without a doubt. Yeah. Click on the audio link. We do ship anywhere. However, keep in mind um, – you know, you got to pay for the shipping and the packaging and the handling, and a lot of the stuff has really become a little bit erratic this year. Yeah, well, it's, um, yeah. but we'll still do that for you, and uh, so keep that in mind if you got, especially in the smaller stuff. But if you're looking at a table or chairs or something big, it's better off you come get it. And the other thing is, is the problem is we haven't been getting anybody for you ship or that type of thing. I suppose we could do some common carrier, but. I don't think most people realize how much a common carrier cost is. And it's been difficult to do that lately too. It really has. They, they yeah. haven't been real. They haven't been real interested in dealing with just the public. Um, no. There's been a couple of cases where I know some people that have have gone to great lengths to ship something common carrier, and and it never happened. The guys are supposed to sh show up on a specific date, and they never showed up, and it makes it difficult for us, and it makes it difficult for you as well. Um, so anyway, coming up though. Coming up, we've got some great items coming up here yet. Um, we've got a ways to go. Um, 368, we've got a vintage Pepsi Cola waste can uh, by Bennett Manufacturing. That's um, It's got a flip lid on it that I think the spring is weak on that, but um, it's it's nice. That's at $55 right now with two minutes left on it. Um, we've got a pair of Montgomery Ward LP heaters. Um, that's lot 366. Those were used to keep the inside of the um, uh, Pepsi trucks from keeping the pop, pop from freezing you know, okay in, in the cold weather they keep it at you know a low, at a little bit higher temperature so it doesn't freeze sure um 369 we've got a set of four truck tires these are p265 70 r17s they're in good condition one of them's got a little bit of wear on the side but these are really nice i'd say they're at least what 60 percent tread maybe more uh, 368 we got a vintage pepsi cola waste can by benedict manufacturing right there that's at 60 bucks <laughs> uh anyway um, uh, 370 we got a uh, nice six shelf unit um that's uh and that's real wood it's not it's not composite um it's real pine um then there and then uh, we have three was there nine nine pairs of winter boots on that shelf too that uh that's a different lot um that's lot 371 those are in pretty good condition um, lacrosse too in there yeah no, kids boots yeah pack boots yeah they're there's actually there's um, some military some flight military boots. military flight boots in there as well. Um, I forgot about that. Um, and then we've got a tote full of soft rock and flower power CDs. Summer breeze. Oh my gosh! And flower power, dude. We got uh, black is black. And put your hand in the hand of the man from Galilee. Something. <laughs> laughing the guess who red rubber ball that's a flower power song that don't sound like it to me i guess maybe hey, anyway 373 we get that large wooden wine rack that hold a lot of bottles of wine man it sure would 27.50 yep any uh, sign that those heaters work 444 let me check what did you say about those uh, heaters are no. they gone uh there is no sign that i mean they, they come with hoses but we were not able to test them they're gone anyway Oh, are they? Or are you see talking about the 373, oh, oh. 7378? Oh, the the um, Blue flame, crazy world, or cozy world. Um, I was told that uh, the, the two that are used were used um, at ball games and stuff for the concession stand to keep. Um, and you know they they were working when when he put them in the storage unit. So that's all I can tell you about them. Oh my gosh, here's my bane, the red comic fire, comet fire extinguisher. Yeah. Didn't last time we had one of those? Uh, somebody broke it. I think that was me, wasn't it? Or was no, it no, that was, you? That was me. Oh, okay. Oh, that oh. makes me feel better. <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, but you don't see those very often, especially ones that are whole. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> those uh, heaters are, um, I mean, that, that's a good buy. That's a good buy because I've been looking at getting one for myself. 
and the 10,000 BTU units are 139 or $145 at uh, Maynard's. Um, so I mean, 40 bucks for a used one. That's that's pretty reasonable. And then there's another one down here, a little ways. It's new in the box. Yeah, 384. That's the new 65 in the box. 65 bucks. Let's 65 go on that. bucks. Yeah, that's that's half price. Um, help help your community. Yeah, definitely. Um, yeah. So we've got um, you know those are those are nice items. Um, then that uh, the 385, that antique clover farm store calendar, 19 from 1942. That's pretty nice. Um, 386, we've got a lot of seven fluorescent fixtures. That's all I can tell you about those. Hmm. There they are. Oh, my. Uh-oh, there goes a fire truck. You must have heard about that fire extinguisher we had in here. Must have. We have 111 open lots tonight still. We have over 250 bidders online, 257. Let's see what we got here. Brand X, 257. Anyway, there we go on that. Um, we have 257 open bidders bidders on tonight. We thank you that you're yep. all here. Welcome you all here. Yep. And you all come back, too. You all come back now, you're here. You stay on for this next one because uh, we got a lot of great stuff coming up, yep. too, for um, – the following auction so we're going to be moving over to that and probably We've got some nice pyrex coming minutes. up here shortly too well pyrex on jimmy's here yeah all jimmy's. right yep 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 there's, we got uh, all sorts of different stuff like lot 387 there's uh eight small fire king milk glass dishes um 389 we got those five pieces of dove x pots and pans they were pretty nice 390 we got seven pieces of pyrex and amber glass ovenware um uh, 391 we got a pair of cast iron skillets 392 we got eight pieces of cookware mural saucepan and more i think we also will be uh sending out invoice with the sign up genius i i think you'll see it on the invoices tonight and again use that use that if you can because it helps us and it helps you because what it does for you is you don't get there and have 30 people in, in line ahead of you. And it helps us because it, it, it levels the load out so we're able to do a better job for you. Yep. Um, that's really what we want to do. Um, you know, we're, we, We'll go in there Monday. We'll have everything ready for you ahead of time um, so that when you get there, your stuff will all be in a, in a specific area or we'll have it listed out where it's at. Um, but it makes it a lot easier if, if people come there in an order fashion, orderly fashion. So use the... Um, Use a sign up. It's 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 a good deal. The nineteen forty two calendar is that uh, Rockwell on the top there? I don't know. Looks like a Norman Rockwell. Yeah, it does. So uh, Norman Rockwell, gosh, that used to be really popular. There's at ten bucks now. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Red Comet fire extinguisher still at twelve. That's way below the money. Yeah. So uh, we've and, got some nice Pyrex coming up here. You know, um, the cool thing about those fire extinguishers, you could use it. For decorating, but then if you needed it for a fire, it still works. Oh my! And supposedly they work amazing. Yeah, that's what aren't they? Yeah, kind of. It's like a reverse. It's they like when you open action. when what the, the the you know those movies that they open the you know portal to another dimension. Yeah, they close. Right in there. Just <laughs> that's what it's like. I hear. Yeah. Anyway, so I've been told. So three ninety three. We've got a pair of large uh, Pyrex tab mixing bowls. Um, these are in the gooseberry uh, pattern on them. Yeah, one's pink and one is yellow. These are both, I believe, four-quart bowls. Um, they're in good condition. I don't believe we saw any chips or cracks on them. Um, lot 394, we've got another pair of Pyrex. One of them is tabbed, one of them is not. Um, and then we've got uh, 395, we've got a pair of Pyrex mixing bowls. Um, lot a number 401 and a 402. These have the crazy daisy pattern on them or, or the spring flower pattern and they're um these are stacking there's just two of them but they're they're um, opposite colors these are all really nice i mean the um the first the pink and yellow tabbed ones those are nice bowls you don't you don't see the pink ones very often um but yeah there's there's some, some cinderella good, pink good there. there we go yeah there's some good value in that uh lot 396 we've got a large box of pattern glass uh, 397 we got six vintage bells and five are brass um, 398 we've got six pieces of corningware with um, 
glass lids on them. And uh, three ninety nine, we got eleven pieces of decorative potter pottery. Five bucks right there. Wow. Royal Copley, that used to be some good stuff. Cast yeah. iron, uh, the Coca Cola duck uh, or die cast, I should say, uh, coin bank. Oh, look at the 408 Vintage Ice Cream Parlor Table and Chairs. 70 oh, bucks. Oh, my. $95 or 95 open lots. Yep. Still moving. Look at, all, look at all the garden hoses. I mean, there's a lot of them there. There is. Yep. And they were all in good condition. Yeah. They yeah. all used, but they're all in good condition. Yeah, so 408, we've got that's a smaller ice cream table. There's two chairs with it. Um, that's at $75 right now. It's got five minutes left on it. So there's plenty of time. Now we've got some nice canning jars coming up here. Um, and that first one is three glass half gallon jars with Presto lids, two of them have Presto lids on them. Um, we've got that 407, we got that set of uh, uh, Chevy mud flaps. Um, 409, we've got that other ice cream parlor table that's got four chairs. Um, I believe, right? Yep, yep, yep. And that's a little that's a larger table, too. The chairs are a little bit taller than they are in the other one, but um, you got, I mean, these. Um, like these half gallon jars with the Presto lids, you don't see those very often. I mean, they're 18 bucks right now, but man. Yep, um, check them out. Uh, let's see, antique dome top trunk. It's yeah. pretty nice. 105 there for you. The never break trunk. <laughs> I don't know if they could say that anymore. Yeah. I think I could probably break that. Well, I mean, we got shipping companies that could do it for us. That's true. <laughs> well played, El Capitan. Well played. Yeah. 413 um, pile of miscellaneous wood pieces. That's some nice stuff in there. I mean, it depends on what you want to use it for, but there's 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 stuff up to what, 42, 48 inches long. Oh, I think you get at least four or five hours of good burning in that. Oh, too, yeah, anyway. definitely. All right, 414, we got a plastic Rubbermaid trash can with lid and wheels. 415, we got a white nightstand. That's at eight bucks right oh, now. Oh, man, that was great. White nightstand. There you <laughs> go. Well, that's a, yeah, that's a perfect uh joke for gosh madrigal anyway yeah. there we go 416 nice glass aquarium with light that's Bed a full cover light to seven dollars yeah 417 we got eight blue glass ball jars with with uh bales and uh i think most of them have uh glass lids on them as well and they are yeah. kind of that normal blue it it almost looks yep. like it's cobalt, but they're yep. kind of normal, aren't Five, they? Yeah, those are normal. Five of them have uh, blue glass lids on them as well, so that's really nice. Yeah, it's kind of unusual to find all those with the uh, bales like yep. that. Then uh, um, 418 is an unusual pair. There's two one-gallon clear jars with bales. These do not have lids on them, but they do have the bales, and you don't see that very often at all. No, not a one-gallon. Not a one-gallon, uh, no. No, that's an unusual size, definitely. I mean, half-gallon is... is Scares, but the one yep. gallon I would say is is close to rare. Yep, definitely. Uh, four one gallon pickle jars, two have lids. That's four twenty one, four twenty. There's some more jars. We got a bunch of jars coming up, but yep. uh, don't discount them. No, there's. Um, I can tell you that in in some of these lots, there's some obscure names. Uh, there's there's um, one box that has um, a Sterling jar in it. There's a Hazel Atlas that's got the logo on the side of the jar. There's um, Brockway in one of these lots. There's, um, I'm trying to think, uh, Foster. Uh, there's a couple, There's several lots that have Foster. There's, there's probably lot. some Smith, too. <laughs> no. no. Wrong, I, wrong I, thing. Forget wrong, about it. Yeah, yeah. Bad joke. Bad joke. Oh, my. Not necessarily. But anyway. Yeah, there no, there's, there's, some, there's some really, and, and they're all usable. You know, if you like to do canning, there's a lot of jars here. Um, uh, you know, um, if you're into collecting some of them, there's some, there's some good collectible jars in here as well. But you can, can a piece. <laughs> I say that right? Sorry. <laughs> yeah, 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 what he said. 78 lots here. <laughs> uh, we're going to be switching over in just maybe five, three, four minutes here, El Capitan. Do remember one thing, though. The end of this auction, we've got the two um slot machines so don't forget that because um they're the last well there's a there's a pepsi machine a working pepsi machine at the end for cans and there's uh two, two slot machines yeah and two slot machines and that's that's the last three items in the auction so 
Um, yeah, don't don't forget those because you're not going to be happy with yourself if you do. But we've got a lot of jars coming up right in here. Um, a lot of these are at two, three dollars a bunch. You know, it's um, you know twenty-four pint jars, uh, hazel, cur, and ball are three dollars. So you know, there's some there's some good good value here, especially if you do canning. And like I said, there's there's some interesting ones in here if you don't. What are you saying is is you can can with these? Yeah, that's right. You can yeah. can. That's right. All right. Uh, I don't know if Artemis is out there, but uh, let's see. We'll give some shout outs here. Who's out there? Probably uh, who would be lurking out there? I don't know who's watching. Is anybody watching? I'm not sure. There hello. Might be some lurkers. Is anybody out there? Yeah. Anybody hello. at all? <laughs> not sure. That was on a movie. I think it was on uh, Dark Side of the Moon album. Yes. Oh, that's right. Yep. All right, so we've got again, we've got there's there's a lot of blue pint glass jars coming up. There's um, there's actually there's a green ribbed um, who's your cabinet coffee canister. Oh, nice. In one of the lots coming up does not have a lid, but but it's got the label on the, on the jar. Uh, so that's coming up. Um, so there, there's a lot of good stuff. There's there's a dozen bale top jars with glass lids. There's you know lots of and there's a Two boxes full of zinc lids with glass inserts. There's another box of glass uh, lids. And there's two packages of Presto lids, um, you know, with with the the rim and the glass insert. So I mean, there's there's a lot of great stuff coming up. Anyway, we are gonna send jump it. Over. We're gonna we're gonna take a little about a minute break here. We're gonna jump over to the other one. We thank you and. Uh, Check this one out. Keep bidding on the Jim Stever auction, but then jump over to AJ's too. You could double screen it. Woohoo! Woohoo! It's fun. That'd Try it. That'd be some serious. Oh man, stuff. it's a lot of action. Lots of action. We like action. At the poker table. All right. We'll see you in a bit. Thank you. All right, I'll cap you down. Let's see here. Uh, I think we're doing okay. Did we get 20 